Welcome back, lovelies. Today's video, as you've seen from the thumbnail, my Jeffree Star Mystery Box finally arrived. It seems like I'm on the end of the scale, but that is okay. So we're going to open it up today. We're going to see what's inside. And if you would like to see that, then consider subscribing and hit that like button if you enjoy this video. And let's get into my box. Now it's right here. I don't want to show my address. It has not been opened. So I'm going to open it real quick. I'm going to set it aside and we're going to start pulling. Now, just like with my um, Jeffree Star Beautylish box, I'm sure I'm going to get a lot of dupes. But that is okay because then I can give them to you guys and to family members. Now, why I'm cutting this, I can tell you guys, I was literally, it is 11 o'clock at night. I had taken my nighttime medication and I was going to bed. And then I received the package at 11 o'clock at night. But hey, it is what it is. I'm happy it's here. Actually, one second, I'm going to clear a spot on my desk and we're going to get into this. I've got a spot cleared. And I know you guys like my um, kind of organizing videos where I get all my stuff and I keep collecting it in a box. And then I have a ton to organize and put away. Well, trust me, since I've been sick, I have two big boxes of things that I've ordered and received and shown you guys and now have to put away. So that'll be coming. But let's open this box. Well, I can't keep it open, but let me turn the camera and show you what I see. As you can see, this is what I see and the lid will not stay open. But there's that box, this giant box full, and this box is all full. So let's turn around and get into that box get all the paper out and let's start pulling okay so we're st and you know let me say something really quick I honestly believe because I've watched a lot of unboxing videos and yes his boxes might not be the most amazing in the world mind-blowing but I honestly believe a lot of people buy these boxes to make videos just to shit on Jeffrey now I know he is not the best person and i know his boxes are not always the best but they're pretty damn good for the money point and i honestly think people just like to shit on him and make stuff up to get views that's just what i think so let's get back to this so first we have private island now i see people get these nobody shows you guys what they look like so i'm going to it's like a taupey brown that's actually very pretty i like colors like this so that is private island Next, we have a Supreme Gloss. I hope it's a shade I don't have because I really enjoy his glosses. And it is. This is improper. Oh, I'm so happy so I can keep it because I have Wifey and Red Affair. Oh, my. It is like a pinky purple mauve, but I'm going to keep it. And, of course, you know it has the woo-woo. Oh, I got the hiccups applicator. That's actually really pretty. Let me fix this. I didn't get any more product. I just want to get this gloopy spots out of the way. That is actually gorgeous. I did not think I would like it, but I actually love it. And that is what the container looks like. So I'll go ahead and throw this away since I don't need to put it back in there because I'm going to be keeping it. So next, we have a gloss. This is from the... Um, I can't think of name, but, but something money collection. And this is in peach price tag. I have a feeling I'm going to like this color too because I like peachy colors. And oh, yes, I do. So far, this box is popping off for me. Because usually by now, all three of these would be given away. Not saying this one isn't, but I'm not sure yet. But how gorgeous. Oh, my lordy be. And out of all the glosses I have, I have a lot of different tops, but none of the green ones. So, and really quick, you guys, these fruity lip oils, this one is strawberry melon number 120. It's what I have on. Do you see this? I'm getting a damn cold sore. I hate cold sores. But here's the applicator, if you guys do not know. It's a little bit slanted on one end, straight, or one on the bottom and on the top it's straight and the rest it's just rounded see if you guys are able to see that oh yeah you're definitely 
able to see what that looks like. That is gorgeous. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, and it smells like, to me it smells like a cupcake, like a vanilla cupcake. So we have that. So far, so good. Oh, I think, is this the, um, I don't know. Cutthroat, uh, Cutthroat Love. I don't think this is the, um, exclusive because I'm pretty sure everybody's been getting a pinky color. Oh, and I love that. Love, love, love it. Sorry if my voice sounds horrible. I've been coughing all day, so I apologize for that. But that is beautiful. It's like a, a reddish brown with like a little bit of an orange undertone. Oh my God, that is beautiful. I don't think it's the exclusive, but if it is, I ain't mad at it. Because look, it's holographic on there. And I don't think they're supposed to be. But that is Cutthroat Love, which I will also be keeping. This box is popping off right now. We have a liner and mannequin. Now, this I might not be keeping. This is a very, like, cool tone pinky color, if I remember. Oh, maybe not. Because look at that. Like, look at that. And then look at that. Not even close. Unless they put the wrong one in here. No, right there it says mannequin. That is a beautiful color, so I was wrong. I will be keeping this. Look at that. It doesn't look like that. It definitely doesn't look like that. But I love the color nonetheless. Sorry if you heard that. Boop! That is my Xbox because I bought myself the new one. Okay, so let's see what we got. <gasps> Open for nudes. Hold on. Okay, I had to go and look, and I do own this. But for those who don't know, it's like this very soft matte feel. Nothing there. Wait, no, I do not own this. Mine says volume two. So this must be volume one. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me go look. You, Sorry if the angle changed. But you guys, this might be the best mystery box I have ever gotten. And I have ordered them from his very first mystery box. I've ordered every single one. All of them he put every year for every year. If that made any sense. But I have volume two and this is volume one. I I checked the names on the back to see in my volume two and they are different. So this has skin tight, mannequin, celebrity skin, posh spice, rose matter, Gemini, Leo, and androgyny. Sorry, got a phone call. But that is all the names and I will swatch all of them for you. And here is what they look like. Now I won't lie these first three look an awful lot of light. Well, maybe not. Maybe these two, because that one looks more pinky. But either way, let's swatch them. So, first we have Skin Tight, which looks very pale. So, it would probably be something I would use. Oh, maybe not. I could... Look, does that not look like an... Does that not look like a freaking heart? And you guys seen I did not do that deliberately. Okay. Let me see. Can't really smell if these have any scent. Next, we have Mannequin. Which definitely looks like a nude I would wear. And let me say no. These are not dried out. Just let me put that out there. And I, to be honest, I don't think the other ones... Maybe one or two, but all those people that said they were dried out just needed to shake them. I do think maybe one or two of them were, but I think it just became a bandwagon thing. Just what I think. Then we have Celebrity Skin, which is one of my all-time favorites. I have the full size of this. Celebrity Skin. I think that will bloop up there because it won't be able to dry otherwise. Then we have Posh Spice. Very pretty cool tone nude. Love this color. That's Posh Spice. 
Then we have Rose Matter. I don't see how that's a nude, but it's gorgeous nonetheless. And I'm not a big pinky person on my lips, but this is beautiful. I hate those little bloops. So that is Rose Matters. Yes, no, Rose Matter, no S on the end. Then we have Gemini, which is another one I love. See, it had a little bit of holes right there. Shake it up and it's fine. This is Gemini. This is more of like a, like an orangey undertone nude. So that was Gemini. And we have two left. We have Leo, which I think is beautiful. It's a more warm tone nude. That is Leo. And then last we have Androgyny, which is a pinky tone nude, and I absolutely love this. It's like a mauve tone nude, maybe. And you guys seen none of them were dry. So that is all of my volume one nude lip bundle. So we have that. Oh, and by the way, I didn't even start off saying I got the Supreme, which was $180. I don't remember the overall value that you are supposed to get. I got a Velvet Trap, Celebrity Skin. I think I might have this one. It looks like that. So I'm not going, actually I am going to swatch it because even if I don't have it, my daughter-in-law will take it. No, I do not have this one. I can tell right now by the swatch. The one I have is more of a warm tone nude. That is gorgeous. And by the way, they're magnetized. And also for those who do not know, they feel kind of furry a little bit. The stars you see, they're, they're actually really cool. So we have that. I do love the boxes too. They, they go on like this and they look like this. By the way, they are cruelty free. I do not know if they're vegan, but I do know they're cruelty free. So we'll get rid of that box because we, not one thing so far, not one thing, but I, I know something's coming. If I get the orgy palette, it'll be given away to somebody, family or you guys. Oh, I think this is the, the light. comes wrapped like this. Now I'm recording on my phone so I can't stick it on my phone and show you guys but this is about how big it is. It is adorable. It would go on like this so your camera would be right here and if you were taking it for the back you would just turn it around like that if you was taking a picture from the back. It does not come with batteries. Let me make sure. Oh my god Jeffrey. Hallelujah. He sent it with batteries different colors so there's regular lighting no 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 oh my god you guys probably can't tell but look here they're like the regular lighting and the warm tone lighting together and then nothing so we got the warm tone the regular and the regular and warm tone together which it's pretty bright but i don't think it's charged all the way because there's the charging port or actually no what am I talking about? It doesn't take batteries. You charge it. Duh, Michelle. So I have a feeling it'll be a lot brighter when you charge it. It does come with the little charging cord and it does come with the little directions. So we got that. And our shirt. Now I did get mine an extra large. And I don't care what anybody says. His shirts are so soft. I still wear the ones from the other boxes. And it has the star with the broken heart because he was going anti-Valentine. And then here is the back. Heartbreaker with the star and the heart. The broken heart, I should say. And then that's it. The rest of it's just black. And it's like a pink, pink, and like a coral color. Oh, I love this shirt, you guys. 
So we got that. We got a lip scrub. A velour liquid. Velour liquid. A velour lip scrub. Oh my god. We got rainbow freaking sherbet. I actually have wanted this for a while. But I didn't buy it because I'm, I'm still going through lip scrubs of his. I'm working on one now. I haven't, which is Blue Raspberry Sucker. I haven't even gotten to the Halloween one. And now I have Rainbow Freaking Sherbert. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. Is this, this is Rainbow Sherbert, right? Yes, Rainbow Sherbert. And if you, well, if you pull out a tub of Rainbow Sherbert and give it a sniff, that's exactly what this smells like. I don't understand how he gets his scent point on. But we have that, which I will be keeping. Wow, you guys, I am so surprised. Our next single shadow is Divine Intervention. Let me show you what it looks like. This is sparkly. It's like a cream colored shadow with sparkles. I know you can't see the sparkles, but they are there. So we have that. I'm guessing this is the highlighter palette. Here's the book. Oh, here's the packaging. It says Heartbreaker and it is raised. And look at it. Like all these cracks are holographic. So cute. Here it is. I don't want to blind you. It has a mirror. And here are the shades. Now, I will say I heard a lot of people complaining because this was so dark. Only thing I will complain, not necessarily complain, but I wish he would have took out this one and put like a super light, light, like almost white or cream colored one. Then have the medium toned one and the dark one. But I do like the fact that there are super dark ones for people with super dark skin. Like they can't use, I mean, I guess they could use a white highlighter, but they would have that white cast. So this would work great for them. Honestly, any of these probably would. So I'm not mad. Oh, look when I swatched it, it's like peach and golden underneath. Okay. Now I will say these do not feel, oh, except for that one. These do not feel as soft and creamy as they usually do, but there could be a reason. So here's the three. Look at that shift. Oh my God. Look at that. Look at the pink up here into the like peachy golden. Oh my God. I'm going to space them apart a little bit so I can like rub them out a little bit. Okay. So there's that one. Let's spread it out some. Okay, let's spread out the pink some. And let's spread out the coppery color. That coppery color is dark. I could honestly use that for like a contour if I wanted a little bit of a sheen. Yes, look at that pink. And you know, even if you could not use these as highlighters, which I could definitely use that one. And maybe that one, definitely not that one, but maybe that one if I like sheared it out a lot. But if you could not use these for highlighters, you could definitely use them as eyeshadow. So I don't mind at all. So here's the three colors. That shift on that top one, mm -mm -mm, gorgeous. So we have that. We should have another eyeshadow somewhere. Oh, there it is. And our last, I think our last eyeshadow is called Freak Show. So let's see what it looks like. Ooh, it is just black. Is that black? If it's not black, it's a deep, deep brown, almost black. Kind of like my hair. My hair is not black, but it's pretty close. So we have that. I'm trying to get all the stuff around. Okay, palette time. Yeah. We got the RG. Now, I do have a few things from my Beautylish box that I'm going to do a giveaway with. So I might put this with them 
Or I might give it to my daughter-in-law. I'm not sure yet. Okay, that is everything except for this. The Heartbreaker Mirror. Yes. Okay. Where's my little... My little tool. Um... How the hell did it disappear? And I just used it. I am so confused. One second. Oh, I found it. I guess you didn't have to wait one second. Okay. I think the packaging is adorable. How it has a window. Kind of looks like a candy machine to me. This is too much. I love it. It says heartbreaker and it is raised. I don't know if you'll be able to, yeah, you could see it a little bit that it's raised. Huge mirror. Say hello to yourselves and look at the mess. So cute. So that is the mirror. And like, look how big it is. I don't want to blind you guys. Like, it's my whole head. It's huge. So we have that. So, guys, that was everything in my box. And I can honestly say this is the best box I have ever gotten from Jeffree Star. And for those who do not know what the orgy looks like, let me show you. Here's the packaging. You got Jeffree and lots of other bodies all over the packaging. But I do already own this. But like I said in my other video, I had the mini and I got rid of it because I thought they were the same. Just in a mini version. But it was the all shimmers because this is all matte. And I wish I wouldn't have got rid of it. But here is the orgy. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous all matte palette. So I will let you guys know in the next couple videos what will be included in the giveaway. Or I'll do a video on its own of what I will be putting in the giveaway and how you can enter. It will not be this video. I will do its own video coming up. So if you guys did enjoy, again, like I said, consider subscribing and hit that like button to let me know you enjoyed this video. Hit the notification bell because the giveaway will be coming. There will be one. And I have one going on. An, oh, no, the Instagram one's over. But I did have one going on Instagram. So follow me at my Instagram right here at this so you can be entered in those giveaways because I like to do YouTube ones and I like to do Instagram ones give everybody a fair shot. But with that, lovelies, I will go and see you in the next one. Bye. Really quick, this was the exclusive. That must have been why the uh, stars were holographic. But the thing is, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and the mirror, 11 things. I thought there was supposed to be more than 11 in the Supreme box. So I'm going to have to look it up, and when I edit, I'll put it here. If there was supposed to be more than 11, and if there was, then I got shorted out of some items. I will also add everything up, and I will put the total right here. So let you guys know what my box was worth. Overall, I paid 140 how much did I get? But now, lovelies, I will leave and see you in the next one. Bye.